Hello ACC students, this is Rizman Mania, the trainer of performance management, financial management and advanced performance management at WIFI. Now, this video is specifically for advanced performance management students who are appearing for exams in June 23 attempt. And you might be nervous obviously uh, and you might be uh, in a phase where you're deciding uh, which things are important for you, what to cover first and what not to cover. So first of all, uh, the most important thing that I want to uh, discuss today is about the technical articles. Yes, so many students ask about technical articles and should they read technical articles. So yes, uh, technical articles always provide a rich source of information. And for clarity purpose, these articles are important. So I want to name few articles that you should read before the examination. And this will give you a lot more understanding and clarity in terms of the concepts. So I'm just naming the articles. You just go to the ACCA website, APM section, and you will find these articles. The first one is performance indicators. It's very important always to understand performance indicators for APM. Number two is sustainability and performance management. Number three is data analytics and the role of management accountant. Especially this article is important in today's uh, technological world. Number four, performance report always remains a very hot topic uh, as far as APM exam is concerned. Number five, reward schemes. Uh, yes, reward management, employee management, all is very important for APM. Number six, advanced performance management examiner approach. You must know what your examiner thinks about the paper and what the approach you should follow, what approach he likes you to follow. Okay. Then reading the question requirements of advanced performance management. I always emphasize a lot. So those who are my students, they know the uh, requirements they know how I break the question but in general students who are doing self-study uh, they must know that what the key requirements are after that we have uh, demystifying value-based management uh, after that the next article is reward schemes for employees and management as I always say reward it's very important and then forecasting with data this will give you a good recap of pm as well and it will connect you with apm so these are the articles that you uh, should read and these will be useful for you for advanced performance management i hope this video will answer students questions in relation to technical articles for advanced performance management